What did you sell your first piece for as an NFT? You remember? So the, the first drop that I had was in October. Um, and I had sort of three pieces, two videos, um, and um, then the addition of 100 for a dollar. And so the two videos, one of them sort of uh, changed based on the election. It had sort of an initial state and then it, it was going to change. And this was, again, uh, about five days before the election. Um, so if Biden won, it was going to change to one video. And if Trump won, it was going to change to a different video. So it obviously ended up changing to the, the Biden video. And that's kind of how it will stay from now on. Um, so that piece, those both of those pieces, then I did another piece um, you know, with that for auction. And both of those pieces went for $66,000 to, to Pablo. Um, it's just, you sold them for 66000 but you also did a drop of $1 for yes. the other pieces. Yep. So those were $1 and it was an addition of 100 And so obviously those sold instantly and then people can sort of flip those immediately right through sort of Nifty. This was done on Nifty Gateway. And so people can immediately flip those. And so I, my thinking with that was, okay, I know they're worth more than a dollar, but I, I figured maybe they'd be worth like a hundred dollars. And so immediately within 45 minutes, somebody had flipped the flip one for about a thousand dollars. And it was like, oh my God, like somebody sold that for a thousand dollars. That's crazy. And then by the end of the night, somebody had sold one for $6,000. And it was like, what the hell? Like that is, you know, was just absolutely insane to me. Fast forward now, you can't get one of those for less than $150,000. One went for $300,000. Like it is like insane. Again, those were a dollar in October. So um, when, you, when you think through going from selling $1 pieces to one of your pieces just sold for $6.6 .6 million. Yes, one of those 66000 Yep, one of those pieces that went for sixty-six thousand. You know, Trump in all his glory with no clothes on, laying in the. Uh, in the <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get straight up fucking murdered by one of these QAnon morons. <laughs> what, 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 what happened? Why, why did it go for so much? Who bought it? Why? Like, what, what is going on with a six point six million dollar <laughs> NFT? Well, I think like it, it's one of these things where the whole space is like, you know, going crazy. Like this is not sort of happening in, in a vacuum. And I think people are are sort of seeing, again, obviously the Christie sale was, was a huge impact of that. And people are sort of, um, you know, seeing that, that this could be a massive, massive, um, you know, kind of thing. And me being one of the like, you know, most popular artists in the space, I think they're sort of attaching premiums to that. But there's also been different things that have kind of shown the price sort of, there, there's been different sort of metrics. I think the 6.6, .6, if you're looking at an addition of 100 and those are going for $150,000 each, then you can take the fully diluted value of those 100 and it's like, okay, well, that's like, you know, $10 million for that piece of artwork or whatever, or $15 yep. million. And so looking at the, in the context of that, you're like, oh, well, okay, I guess 6.6 .6 is not just out of nowhere. Um, and then if you factor in like the B20 token, which is this whole other like, you know, I don't know if you want to get into that, but that's a whole other sort of thing that also right now is about $100 million divided by 20 pieces. There you kind of, you know, are coming explain to a that. similar number. I, explain what that is for everyone. So the B20 is uh, kind of a, a, a long story you kind of need to know about, about DeFi to some degree, but I'll try and sum it up, you know, kind of quickly here. But so basically what it is, is um, in my second drop, the, uh, I did like a 2020 collection. And part of that drop, I did 20 individual one of one um, pieces. And so what happened is um, somebody bought all 20 of those pieces kind of sort of secretly throughout the weekend and kind of, you know, sort of tricked everybody and, and ended up getting all of those pieces. And uh, he did that for a very specific reason, because he then took those 20 pieces and built virtual museums for them in Somnium space and Decentraland and a few other places, built virtual museums, bought land, they had museums built specifically for those 20 pieces. Then he took and bundled that all together into a smart contract, locked it into a smart contract and fractionalized that into 10 million shares. So the amount with the, the pieces that he bought, which was about $2.2 million and the land, all said and done, he spent about $3.5 million. 
And as of right now, that B20, and then he split it into 10 million, um, 10 million, uh, uh, you know, sort of fractions and, and made a token out of it. And so right now that token is valued at $91 million if you take the like thing. And this was one month that he did this ago. He did this June, January 23rd. And so it's been on sale a little over a month, five weeks or so, and is now worth $91 million from that initial $3.5 million. Wow. So, um, yeah, it's very like, it's great. It's securitization. It's virtual worlds. It's digital art. It's all this wrapped up is which is why some people are so excited about this. 